Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Toxic Electricity. And what we're looking at is a metal coil mattress and it has its cover removed so you can see all the coils that are inside it. And what we're going to do is with the circuit that is on the right hand side, we're going to switch on multiple electrical circuits and see how that affects the voltage on the metal coil mattress. So this can occur when your mattress is next to walls that have cables running in them or if it's on a floor that has cables running through it. So currently we have a voltage of 0 0.04 and that's going to change as we turn on circuits. So we're going to turn on our first circuit and as we can see the voltage has changed. So we're now at 1.19 AC volts on the mattress. So let's turn on our next circuit. So this is the lamp dimmer. So we're now at 1.62 volts. So let's turn on another circuit. So we're now at 2.16 volts. And our final circuit is 3.08 volts. So as you can see the, the voltage on a metal mattress is dependent on the number of circuits that are nearby it. And most people don't realize this, but when they sleep on a metal mattress, there is actually an AC voltage running around on that mattress. And there can be also be a very wide range of frequencies running around on the mattress because it acts as an antenna system. So I no longer sleep on a metal coil mattress. I now sleep on a foam mattress and I've actually found it improves my sleep. And I think this is one of the reasons why my sleep has improved. I hope you enjoyed the presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.